Right fellas, to find pack a punch, you need to firstly turn on the power. If you don't know how to do that, go check out my guide, I'll smash it in the description. And then after that, you've got to do quite a few little steps, I'd say, little steps. So the first thing you want to do is come to this part of the map once the power is on. And what you want to do is buy this door here. This will be 1,250, I think. Yeah, 1,250. And you want to come into here. And basically, there's a left side and a right side. And you want to go turn on both switches in either side. So there's one switch in the left, one switch in the right. So we're going to go for the left side first. And you want to come down here. And you want to follow the route I take. And then take a left through all this sparkly shit, whatever it's going on. Then take a left up the stairs. Keep on going. And you'll find the switch here. And all you want to do is turn this on, fellas. So that is the left side done. I forgot to mention that this door will cost quite a decent amount of money and so will the right side so you want to come to the right side you want to head down here you want to keep on going straight and you'll come to this switch here turn that one on boom that is both switches turned on so once you've done that you want to head down into bunker and instead of going up to the power switch you want to go this way and you'll find pack a punch down here but you can't actually get to pack a punch because look at that, it's covered by spikes and you've got to do three steps to actually get the spikes off of pack a punch. So what you want to do first is actually press square on this little switch here. You want to press square on that. That will make the cage go up a tiny bit. So you want to do that first and then we'll go do the next three steps. And if you're not sure where the switch is, it's pretty hard to find actually. It's just here opposite the wall by there. There it is fellas. So there's three areas of the map you want to be at. There's three sewer pipes. I'll go to one first. You want to head down here. And as you know, you've got the left and right side. You don't want to go down there. Fucking hell, that shut me up. And there's this sewer pipe here. And all these sewer pipes will open up once you've turned on the right and left side. If you didn't know what the left and right side switches did. So what you want to do is actually go down here. You want to press square. 250 to go down. That's the points. And as soon as you drop, you want to press square as fast as you can on this button. And that will raise the cage up by a bit. Some zombies might spawn, but fucking hell, that is one out of three done, fellas. So, the next one, fellas, is actually pretty far away. So, from the main, well, place of the map where the generator is, you want to go down here towards the riverside. I'm just going to show you the route because it's quite a long way away, is this one. And you want to keep on just following what I do here. You want to go down here. You want to keep the river to your right. And you want to come to open this door here, which is called the pub. As you can see in the top right corner, it's a pub. You want to head up here, and then you want to buy this door here. Make sure you've got some points fucking racking up. And now you're at the tower, and this is the second location for the sewer pipe. And you want to go down here to the left. And the sewer pipe is right there, so we're going to do the same again. We're going to 250 that shit. And we're going to press that button as soon as we can. There it is. We've done that one. That is the next second one. Done. Fucking hell, that shat me up big time. So yeah, watch out for them. So for the third one, you want to go back into the common room. You've got your left and right side, as we know. You want to go down the left side. And you want to go the same route you took earlier to find that power switch. You want to take a left. And you can see the last sewer pipe here. We're going to press square on that one. 250, that shit. What's going on? We're going to pull the switch up. There we go. That is packer punched open there, fellas. We fucking bossed it. There we go. Right, so we're going to go ahead and pack a punch now. There we go, look at that. Looking beautiful is that shit, innit? Looking beautiful. And there's one big thing I need to tell you here, fellas, before I go. When you've run out of ammo, you can actually go back to pack a punch and buy for four grand more ammo from the pack a punch for your gun, which is awesome. Instead of whacking it back in box, trying to get it again, it's there. You can get more ammo. There you go, fellas. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and I'll see you later.